Brain tech, yeah? Where tech is made simple. Last week, Microsoft rolled out their latest version of the Power Toys app, which was released with two brand new tools, the first being Paste as Plain Text and the second Mouse Jump. And I'll leave a link to that video down below in the description. Now, just to let you know that if you are using the Power Toys app, that over the last couple of hours, Microsoft has released um, a patch release to fix bugs they deemed important for stability based on incoming rates. So once the update has been applied, uh, the version and build will be bumped up to 0.68.1. Now, this latest point release update includes four bug fixes. And out of the four bug fixes, three have um, rolled out for the paste as plain text tool, which was a brand new tool, as mentioned, that rolled out last week, which is a quick shortcut for pasting the text contents of your clipboard without formatting them. Now, the default activation shortcut for uh, this paste as plain text tool is, as we can see, Windows, Control, and V. Now, the first fix is that Microsoft says they now support Control and V as an activation shortcut for paste as plain text as requested by some users. So that's due to user feedback. But just take note, Microsoft mentions in the release notes that overriding a default system shortcut might have unintended consequences, quote unquote. So it could cause some issues. So just take note of that. And then the next fix is that um, a paste as plain text now supports pasting multiple times as Control and V does. And you can do that by pressing the activation key while holding the, modif the modification keys. And um, the third and final fix for set paste as plain text, they've now set the default shortcut to Control, Win and Alt and V to avoid conflicting with the new Windows Volume Mixer shortcut. So you also have the option now to set the default shortcut to Control and Win and Alt and V. And as mentioned, that's to um, avoid conflicting with the new Volume Mixer shortcut of Windows 11. And that's the three fixes for Paste as Plain Text. And then the fourth and final fix is for Power Toys Run, which is a quick launcher that has additional capabilities without sacrificing performance. And you can activate that by just using Alt and Space. And what Microsoft say they have done for Power Toys Run, if we just activate that, they've added a setting to disable thumbnails generation for files in order to narrow down the root cause of the crash. So if we head to Power Toys Run and we scroll down just a little bit, yeah, we'll see generate thumbnails from files. Results will try to generate thumbnails for files. Disabling the setting may increase stability and speed. So that's the new setting that's been enabled for Power Toys Run. So that's more or less what's new. Just four fixes that have rolled out in Power Toys version 0.68.1. And Power Toys is a set of utilities for, for our users to tune and streamline their Windows experience for greater productivity and is available for both Windows 10 and Windows 11. Um, from the Microsoft Store, and you can also download Power Toys from GitHub. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.